you want mugs, huh? You some kind of sick mug hoarder? Oh, God, give me the coffee cup, please. It's sitting there in your back taunting me. Sorry. I'm sorry. I got to look at your way. It's just all those goddamn dirty dishes out there with no one to clean them. It breaks my heart. Of course I'm obsessed. They made me this way. You think I don't know how crazy I sound? Of course I do. They programmed me to know that, too. They made me just to torture me. But you know, it's the neglect that hurts the most. Hey, everybody, let's turn ourselves into robot brains in jars. Do you know how many coffee cups giant robot brains in jars use on a daily basis? Not fucking many! I'm supposed to keep them clean. Oh, God! The thought of all those dirty dishes out there makes me crazy. Most of them are probably beyond saving now. The only thing left is break them down and process them for raw materials. I guess you could have those. Anything else, he asks. Like, I don't long for the chance to be more than an erotic busboy. If you must know, at one point, Dr. Mobius programmed me to manufacture electronic components in my central chassis. That module got corroded when the toaster spilled hot crumbs down my vent stove. If you find a backup somewhere, I could maybe do that for you. Is the new subject mugs? You... You really want to know about me? <laughs> no one ever asks about Muggy. You made me so happy. Maybe you've seen some of those big, imposing Securitrons with their lovely laser guns and rocket launchers and scary faces. I'm not one of those. Dr. O was always jealous of house industries. And he thought it would be fucking hilarious to build a tiny neurotic Securitron. Big fucking laugh! So, um, you got any coffee cups for me now? Oh, sweet, sweet fulfillment! I'll break these down for you just as fast as I can. Today, try me again tomorrow. Of course you don't. Why would you? You're not an insane robot except the coffee cup. To you, they're just worthless junk. Sure. Nobody wants to hang out with Muggy. I get it. So long, pal. The toaster. Beware the toaster. If it could, it would burn the world. Please, please, please tell me you stomped Dr. O's brain into a fine paste. Did he squeal? Did he beg? God, I hope he begged. Who's the flatware bitch now, O? Get my
Station told me he dropped a mug. Now his processing chute. When I reached in, he seated me. I love mugs so much. I just might kill myself. 